When you take the spicy chip challenge, there's two things that you're gonna notice pretty much right away. One of those is that your spicy chip is incredibly hot. And the other thing that you're gonna notice is that it's incredibly painful. And folks are wondering, they're coming to pharmacy for, for answers. I have this burn and this pain. How can I, how can I deal with this? There's nothing to me. Ah. <laughs> Is that <a> little? <laughs> what do folks normally do when they, uh, when they have a burn? You go for cold water, ice cold water. Oh, it's hot. <laughs> ice cold water. In, in, in the case of capsaicin and the peppers, does not work well at all. Capsaicins are not soluble in, in ice cold water, so you, you have to drink a whole lot of ice cold water. It will help some with the burning, it, with the hot feeling, but it won't make the pain go away any faster. What we're looking for is some substance that will affect that, what, what pharmaceutics would call the partition coefficient. Get that stuff off your tongue so that it'll stop burning you. One thing you might think of is alcohol. If you're a guy and you're having a spicy chip and a cold beer, you're wondering, is that cold beer going to help me? The answer is it probably will, but most alcoholic drinks have very little alcohol in them, so it's probably not the best choice. One of the other choices you have are dairy products. My favorite is ice cream. I don't think there's anything better than ice cream, because ice cream helps not only with the heat that you're feeling, but also with the pain. By, by take, again, by taking that capsaicin off of its uh, drug receptor. One of the interesting things with dairy is, uh, what do you think would happen if you used skim milk instead of regular milk? Well, skim milk probably won't work anywhere near as well because we're relying on the fat that's in the milk to dissolve the capsaicin and take it away from your tongue. Anybody got some milk? <laughs> but let's get serious with one another. You really want to win the spicy chip challenge, don't you? You can build yourself up by eating you know, progressively more peppers, hotter food, to where you can take the Carolina Reaper challenge and potentially win it. When you do, remember to say, I owe it all to pharmacy.